Now, also within pages, we have the ability to have a significant number of um, ways of arranging things and accessing things. So, um, at the moment, every file that gets saved gets saved individually onto like a wall or a plasterboard or whatever else. Ideally, we really want students and people to be organized so that subjects have their own folders. And it's as simple as like we do on the um, home screen of um, iPads is we push and hold down on top of the piece of paper and sort of everything goes into a wiggle mode. If I drag it on top of another and let go, it creates a tile for that. And it also lets me rename that. Um, so I'm going to call this um, social science. We'll call it science. Um, science is already taken, so I'll call it science two if I need to add more. So then that folder then should be everything to do with my science options. One other thing that you need to remember is, and this is where we have to teach students, and students you must remember this, is that when you save a document, it'll only give it whatever name it come down as, or a blank document or whatever else. So when you're submitting it to your teachers, you really do need to change it so that it is strategic, essay, Brad, Tyrrell. And it needs to have your name before you submit it. It's really, really important because otherwise you will save them all as untitled and uh, as in many number of different things before they'll go up. Um, and you'll just overwrite the other persons when you submit it. So you need to make sure that you're saving everything with your name if you know you've got to submit it.